Hey, hey guys. guys, it's Rachel and Dylan and today I have Dylan here on my channel because he styled me for five complete different outfits and we're gonna see how it went. <laughs> So we're actually doing this video in collaboration with our friends Rachel and Nick here on YouTube, Rachel Ashley. She is so cool and she actually came to Toronto and we had lunch all together um, back in the winter time and we've been really planning to do something together for a long time so I'm so happy that we're finally able to bring this to life. So Nick is actually styling Rachel on her channel and Dylan is going to be styling me on mine so definitely head on over to her video. I'll have it linked in the description box below as well as her Instagram because she She's just super, super cool and seriously one of the nicest people. That being said, what did we do? <laughs> this is Dylan, this is my boyfriend. We've been dating for about six years now. So since we were a little college freshman or whatever you want to call it, and yeah, now we live together. We have a dog. We're very settled. And so I think he has a pretty good grasp of my style, especially because he shoots a lot of my Instagram content, a lot of my YouTube content for me. So I would think that. Were you confident going into this challenge? Not at all. Let's start with day one. Uh, this was like the hottest day ever and we had to run a bunch of errands. So we had to go all around the city. So what I ended up picking was a Chicago's Bowl uh, t-shirt and jean shorts and some sneakers cause it's, you gotta stay comfortable, but you gotta be cool. <laughs> and that's, that's what was I that your, Was that your thought process? <laughs> that, that was, was like, <laughs> how long did it take you to actually put together a jeans Oh my gosh. Outfit? It took me forever because I didn't know where anything was. <laughs> and Fair. we picked a vintage t-shirt because it was the only one that didn't look like you were doing too much. Doing too much? Yeah, it looked like, you know, the right amount of chill, but I got some style. And that's how I picked that one. I actually really like this outfit because it's so something I would have picked out on my own. Honestly, both of these pieces are on like a rotating like basis on just like my everyday life. So hot. It was that so day. hot. It was like you walked outside and it was like just automatically like humid and like an oven outside. So I'm yeah. glad that you picked something that wasn't a sweater or like yeah, a winter no. jacket. You didn't do me dirty. <laughs> Dim sum. Oh, this was uh, it was Sydney's birthday. And it was also a scorching hot day that day as well. <laughs> um, so we wanted to look somewhat presentable, I guess. Like, I don't know, like you wanted to look like you were celebrating something cause it was Sydney's birthday. Um, but you don't want to be too hot. So I ended up picking a dress because I said I picked shorts last time and we should try something different. <laughs> um, What'd you pa pair it with? Do you remember? The I'm shoes? trying to remember the shoes. We were in Chinatown. Yeah, so we wore shoes. <laughs> what? You mean like like full clothes toe shoes? Yeah, clothes, Not just clothes like shoes. shoes like... Yeah, like you don't want your toes to be hanging. Hey, Happy we're dirty. filming. Oh, we were just talking about you. Say hello. Because <laughs> Dylan dressed me for your birthday. How do you think he did on that? I wore a dress. The flower dress. Was it cute? Yeah, it was cute. It looked nice. Thanks. <laughs> Hey, oh, that's in. good. Let's go. <laughs> Let me preface this here by saying Dylan is like Steve Jobs, Mark Zuckerberg, like all those guys who like to wear, well, Albert Einstein, like all those people <laughs> oh who literally like to wear the same thing over and over again. Like he has a uniform. <laughs> he has like his ball shorts, his t-shirts, or he has his jeans from Frank and Oak and his t-shirts <laughs> or a crew neck like if you guys i'm gonna just like post a bunch of examples like he literally like has this like uniform so he pretty much just gave me that this entire week <laughs> that's true i didn't really think about that that time of the day again do i get to pick a new outfit yeah you do am i boring i don't know how to make it creative for instagram Ew. is that not boring well these guys were like this I don't know, I think in my head I wanted like a, a all white outfit. Um, but I couldn't find those things. <laughs> <laughs> so I found the white shirt and that's the one I gave her and I didn't want to wear shorts because I, I needed to switch it up. Top redone jeans. And he knows that because I love my shop redone yeah. jeans. Yeah. So uh, I sang the theme song when I gave her these pants, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> and then we paid it with sneakers because we were going to the vet, we needed to be comfortable, 
And I mean, those are like the main factors that I pick, yeah. think about when picking an outfit, I suppose. And guys, I like this one so much that it ended up on my Instagram. Yeah. And no one commented, obviously, that like, did you pick out your own outfit or not? Because it was pretty spectacular. It looked like something that I would have worn day to day. So I think you're doing a pretty good job. Let's go. Cool. And then the next outfit was yesterday. I went to my friend's pool yesterday and I just needed like a chill outfit. You remember this? It was I yesterday. do remember this. This one is yesterday. <laughs> so this was the easier one to pick. Um, it was, I, I feel like summer's been ending since we started this video. It was super hot and this was like <laughs> the last hot day that we had. So um, we wanted her to keep cool, but I also didn't want to keep everything plain as <laughs> white and jean shorts. Does it make sense? Yeah. Do people wear that? Yeah. I was trying to look for the white shorts and white shirt, but I couldn't find it. Because summer is ending. This was Dylan's idea of color. Um, so I was trying to get <laughs> colorful and I gave her a colorful t-shirt, but I couldn't find anything else to pair it with. So you guys got jean shorts <laughs> and <laughs> Uh, I think we did sneakers. Yeah, we, we did, did feel us. We did the feel and disruptors. Yeah. Honestly, I felt kind of <laughs> like I was 12 in this outfit. Oh. The stripes and then the feelers. I know it's a very like young look and like it looked cute. I thought it was like hypey. Like I was trying to make it look cool. Like, well, <laughs> I didn't know I, it was I, like, I also wore it with like scrunchy, like a scrunchie in my hair. So like I really felt like I was 12. Like oh, I man. personally wouldn't have picked all these pieces together. Oh, like man. I would have definitely had to like offset the striped shirt with like a longer boyfriend jean or I'd have to do like a bigger shirt with like the like these are the shortest shorts I have in my closet right now so like it, it felt a little bit young like I still worked at Brandy Melville you know what I mean but like it was cute and then the last outfit I decided to challenge Dylan because I noticed everything was jeans and t-shirts at this point and I decided to be like okay you're picking an outfit for date night bring out bring it all out pull out all the stops yeah, I didn't, there was one stop. I, like, I wanted to make it look fancy if we were gonna go for a date night, but then it became hot, so I was like, I guess we should pick some color. And we ended up picking a yellow dress. Is yellow your favorite color? No. <laughs> I just thought it was a summer color, so that's why I picked the yellow dress. <laughs> and uh, we put in these heel slipper things. And... I thought it would be a nice, you know, breezy summer dress date outfit. It was so cute when you picked this out because he like laid it all out on the bed for me and I thought that was really adorable. And I decided because I thought it was so cute, I decided to shoot it for my Instagram. So that post is either up now or like will be up. But like we got some bomb photos that day. It was really, really fun. And I decided to kind of just pile on top this yellow cardigan, which Dylan actually originally oh, picked. Yes. And then he put it back. The reason why I had that I had that cardigan out was because I was going for one of those all white outfits. Like if she had like a white, I don't know, like a tank top and white shorts, but I couldn't find those things. That's why we went with the colorful t-shirt. T-shirt? You mean cardigan? No, no, I know the cardigan. I was going to pair the cardigan, the yellow cardigan. Oh, with the t-shirt? No, with the white shirt. But I couldn't find anything oh, white. I, see, I, see. I couldn't find the white shirt and the white shorts. Like that was in my head, but I couldn't <laughs> yeah. find it because I don't know where it is. So then I said, this is my alternate for the yellow color. I was going to mm. get the t-shirt. That's what happened. Yeah, I love this look. We did sandals. The only unfortunate thing about these sandals is that I've never actually worn them <laughs> like out like walking for a little bit. So I have very narrow feet and they kept sliding, but that's like no fault of your own. Yeah, well, so I need like a gel pad in them, but they're very cute. And I love this look. Thanks. You did a good job styling me for the five outfits that I challenged you to. I don't know why it was so stressful. Was it stressful? Aw, <laughs> yeah. oh, well you succeeded. Two out of five. Sorry. That's not so bad. It's not a pass. <laughs> <laughs> well guys, that is the end of my boyfriend styles me for the week. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. You're definitely going to have to head over and see what Nick picked out for Rachel because I'm it's, super curious. It's like, I'm so curious. <laughs> I cannot wait to watch the entire video. I got a sneak peek, but like, 
cannot wait. So if you guys haven't already, you should definitely follow us on Instagram, as well as Rachel and Nick, as well as Toledo if you would yeah. like, because Toledo just hit 200 followers and we're feeling pretty nice about it. With that being said, if you guys want Dylan and Toledo more on my channel, definitely hit the thumbs up and we're gonna go. We'll talk to you guys soon. Bye guys. Bye guys. Bye should guys. we do a Toledo Fix My Outfits for a week? Oh my gosh, that would be so funny. We should just put a bunch of stuff on the floor. And see what he touches? Yeah, or pizza. No! <laughs> then we can't put anything nice on the floor. <laughs>